Hi everyone and welcome back to another video here on the channel. So today we're going to be visiting the Scottish National Game Fair, which is the biggest game fair in Scotland. And as the name would suggest, the game fair goes back to the traditions of country sports like hunting and fishing, but it has evolved over the years to include other things like the traditions of working hunting dogs, which we're going to see some really good clips of later on in this video. And it also includes things like food, uh, camping, and even conservation and wildlife conservation efforts, uh, which are going on in Scotland today. So we're going to get to experience a good bit of that in today's video, guys. That's us in. Uh, we went past a few of the commercial sort of stalls, the entrepreneurs or whatever, and saw a little bit of the dressage there. This is a pretty big place, so probably quite a bit of walking around. And uh, because Stacey never came today, I came with some friends, and I've just had to go to the toilet, so I've left them behind. So I better go find them, which won't be an easy task uh, in a place this big. But I'm sure we'll see plenty of other stuff as we're walking around. Uh, loads of dogs here today, like. Just everywhere you go, there's dogs, most of them hunting breed dogs, but uh, it's just lovely to see so many people out for this. A little bit more of a walk around. We're not even halfway around yet, but I've got a lot of pine, so we're gonna hang out here where all the food stuff is for a little while. Hey guys, just had a nice chat with the people from Gilbertson Page. We've also got a stall here. So remember to head over to Gilson Page's website and get your 15% discount off orders inside the UK. So now we're heading up to something, but how you getting on? So guys, as I was saying there, is, uh, we're just heading over to the sort of fishing bit now. So uh, right up my street, so we'll see what's going on here. In the water to grip my line to feed it out. And this white section of my line that you can see is what we call a shooting head. And this is the weight of the line that we use to go against the rod. So you'll hear some phases in spear casting. The most common ones are the D loop. For anybody who doesn't know, a D loop is this line here that's hanging behind the tip of my rod. Imagine a bow and arrow. How do we load the rod? The bigger the D-loop, the bigger the power, the more load we get on the rod to get further distance. So, here we go. Roll cast with a line on. And what we need to do here now, which is very important, 
is always keep intention in your line. The minute you put slack in your line, the minute you're going to have problems. So we start with the roll cast. Let me just bring it down. The reason, just before I go into that, is why would we do a roll cast? Because the roll cast is not going to get us to the other side of the river. So why would we use the roll cast? Well, it helps us put tension in the line. It helps us reposition our fly line. It helps us get our fly line up onto the surface, especially in the springtime when we are fishing heavy flies. Okay, so we're gonna lift, keeping it nice and smooth and consistent. Got a D-loop form in there. And then I'm finishing with a forward roll cast, stopping it high, following it through with the line. So I spend a lot of time doing the roll cast because no matter what other cast I go to do, out of 12 or whatever spare casts there is to do. All right guys, we're moving on again to the working dogs demonstration. So guys, that was the sort of amateur, sort of working dogs, traditional gun dogs type competition. If we go over here, we've got sort of a, a bigger one, a more professional uh, competition going on over here as well. The, the hundreds and hundreds of hours yeah, of practice yes, that have gone into achieving that result, that very, very obvious distraction. Quite a pull for the dog until they learn to trust the handler uh, and accept direction of someone. Thank you. 
picked very, very nicely done. Of course, you can't go to the game fair without embarrassing yourself at the target shooting competition. Thank you. 